what are we up to today? Well, not motorbikes. We're going kayaking, canoeing, and we're gonna kayak, canoe up the Ariège River. So there's a plan, as always. Whether we stick to it, we'll see. We're gonna park one car here, Porte Sugaron. Drive the other car down the highway, down to a place called Grepiak. Put the boats in there, and then paddle our way up, all the way back to where car number one's parked. Uh, about 20 kilometers total. Uh, the book says it's a class one, class two river, not too hazardous. If one dodgy bit round about there, or so it says. So we shall see how it unfolds. Looking forward to this adventure. Start of the Great Ariage River Run. Boat on top there. I think it's called a canoe or kayak or something. <laughs> Going to leave one car here. It's a beautiful day. Uh, are we ready to rock, Mickey? Ready. Let's do it. Let's depart Rue de Beck. Where are we going? Grepiac. Grepiac, 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 uh, whatever. Run, Just arrived, getting the boats off, getting inflatable pumped up, getting ready to go. He's over there somewhere, relieving himself. So here we are as normal, waiting for Mick because he takes forever getting prepared. Oh yeah, well, because I don't know how to do this. Um, I've been ready for about 20 minutes and... Uh, this rubber mat. He does faff around a bit, that boy, that's for sure. But, it's a lovely day. We got time. A couple of old retired blokes. The boy is finally ready with his very uh, natty. All high teched up here. <laughs> Looks really? like he's got a neck, Ten kilometer height neck going. protector on. <laughs> 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 yeah, We're going over there. We're going over there. It's quite a long walk. Let's do it. Do you look like Red Bull Adventurer? <laughs> Riverside, so we've just trekked through the uh, Amazonian jungle for four days. And uh, shorts ended up on that little jaunt. Shorts are down by the knees. And we've ended up at a raging river. We need about a day to recover now from the hike. Here he goes. I'm going to commit. And once he's away, I'm going to join him. How was that for you? Exhilarating. <laughs> So we've just pulled in, we've been on the water 45, 50 minutes. We've had a few exciting moments, nothing too hectic, too crazy, all good. So we're having a coffee and a croissant. And uh, where are we, Mick? <laughs> Between Grepiak and Murray, I guess. We're on Desert Island. Desert yeah. Island, yeah. I just sort of pan it round. We're, we're sort of in the middle of the Ariage River between where it divides on this island so yeah very nice well, we'll be able to spot this from google earth on right? google earth yeah so that will do just had our lunch or a tea break with croissant mix trying out the head cam and then realized he's left his phone on the side there unbelievable that was lucky so we're about to push off now continue down the river Lovely. Just trying to get across this weir and the boat bottomed out so I've had to climb out and Mick's had to climb out as well. Too much. Uh, a bit of portage. <laughs> I'm going to have to line mine down. Alright, here we come. 
Lovely. Some people on the beach up there. I can you see them? Awesome. Oh, that was interesting, wasn't it? I lost my steering completely. Did you get stuck on the mud? Just, no, I just wouldn't go where I wanted. Like the current got me. Yeah. Ooh, bumper cars. Um, weird. Either one of my fins has ripped off or it was just the current. There we come down bridge number four or five. Last bridge to go under. A lot of debris there. We had an interesting moment earlier on. So we're over halfway now. What's happening, Michael? What's going on? That's the lunch. That's the lunch. It's now, we've been on the water two and a half hours. I think we deserve a lunch break. And we just, we just came come down. down. The interesting little set up here. Uh, good time to stop, I think. It's going to get a bit bumpy in the next 200 metres as well. Well, we'll be okay. Will we survive? So. To be discovered. <laughs> Keep watching. <laughs> Tune in. A lot of people ask life too short uh, about the equipment we use and uh, who supplies it. So here we've got an example. This is Mick's seat, which um, comes from what did it come from exactly, Mick? It comes from those robots that clean swimming pools and the rotors, and uh, they were defunct. So I've kind of, um, what's the word, not upgraded them, upcycled them actually. Up. They're, not, they're not that successful. Upcycling, you heard it here first. And uh, my shoe supplier, <laughs> uh, this is a, a traditional water shoe, it's got big holes to let the water out once the water enters. Very high tech. Uh, we've got the proper dry bag there. Yeah. Uh, booty things, yeah. The rest is pretty, let's say, traditional. So, no, Mickey Donut, would you like to talk us through what just happened to you in that river? I went for a swim. Let me have a look at these legs. Oh, it's only the only grazed up. And it's got a bit of blood. Um. Yeah. I went for a swim. Oh, was you a bit too hot? No, I mean, I just bounced, bounced over. The boat comes over the top of me. Is that a new technique or something? hard because there's a lot of rocks on the bottom and the, we're hitting my legs and my feet and the boat was crashing into the rocks and then to try and get it across the river so we could get on some uh, to empty the water out. Oh, it Sounds very dangerous. It was terrible. <laughs> now where it's are we? <laughs> we're, on, we're somewhere in France yeah. on the side of the river. Oh, Happened up there somewhere. Made it. How long did it take us? Four and a half hours? Uh, we got in about up half past two. two. What time we start? Ten. So four and a half hours and a couple of you know excursions, diversions. So <laughs> let's get close up to them. Yeah, nice. Yeah. I like it. Very stylish. Bounced what... off the bottom of the riverbed in a few nasty rocks that sunk the boat, but it popped back up, which is good. Unbelievable. Testament to Grumman Engineering. However, I'm a bit disappointed in the shockproof, waterproof Fuji underwater yeah, camera. Why, why are we filming with my phone at the moment, Mike? Mick? Your, your camera's what? Your waterproof camera? Shockproof. Your waterproof <laughs> system. It's a dead camera. I think it had a bumpy ride under it. I don't know if it's oh, meant to mean be. It had a few shocks and a few. got a bit of water, the waterproof, shockproof camera. How long was I in the water for? How long was it? 15 minutes? 10 minutes? Very hard to say. Felt like about 15 hours, but uh, yeah. quite a long time. Anyway, the good news is I do okay. not have to explain to your wife how you died, which yeah. is awesome! Yeah, I'm very happy with that, yeah. Right, let's go to the other car. Get loaded get some up beer. and get the other car. Yeah. We made it. Uh, we made it just. Just. Cheers, dude. What an adventure. Never did it taste better than after. This is the best like this that. year. The best this year, for yeah. sure. No doubt.